Zap, zap, zap. How to tattoo a sweet potato? Is this the future for our vegetables? Swedish supermarket giant Isai is trialing laser marking its sweet potatoes and avocados in search of an environmentally friendly alternative to traditional plastic stickers or packaging. The experiment is called natural branding. A low energy carbon dioxide laser is used to quickly remove pigment from the outer skin of a fruit or vegetable. It's a new technique and uh, we are being uh, searching for a smarter way of uh, branding our products uh, due to the fact that we, we think that we have too much unnecessary plastic material or packaging material on our products. The vegetables started getting their tattoos last December and the experiment was scheduled to last five weeks. Now it's been extended to March. These etched markings give the product's name, country of origin and code number. It's claimed the process has no negative effect on the taste, smell or the shelf life of the fruit or vegetable. It gives the product a, a natural light, uh, a bright light, which uh, make the um, pigments of the fruit skin vaporize and it leaves a mark. Uh, and it's very delicate because the mark is not uh, going through the skin in any way. It doesn't affect the quality or the taste of the product. The skin of sweet potatoes and avocados are not normally eaten, so the supermarket said they were ideal for the trial, as well as the fact plastic stickers often fall off them. But there are times plastic packaging is required to extend a product's lifetime. The plastic branding, uh, there is, of course, there is positive things with it. Uh, some products uh, really, um, you help the shelf life with specific material. Uh, so there is, it's just not... Um, an enemy for us, uh, but in some items it's just unnecessary because it doesn't bring you better shelf life, it just brings you extra costs. Next up for the experiment could be a fruit like an apple, says the supermarket chain. The skin of an apple is of course eaten. So central to these trials' success will be shoppers' reaction and whether they want their fruit and veg with a tattoo. Uh, it's actually the first time I see this branding, but uh, if it's a more sustainable alternative, uh, I'm all for it. I have two kids, so they were very important to me. So I try always to look, you know, at the the, the good stuff. Uh, I try to think about the environment. So I think this is perfect for us. But laser marking can't be used in everything. Citrus fruit skin has a unique ability to heal itself, so the markings disappear after just a few hours. But any reduction in the use of plastic packaging has the backing of the environmentalists. We know there's a huge amount of waste across the supply chain before we get to the packaging we see on our shelves. We know that manufacturers and retailers have been trying to decrease this, um, but you know they're, they're not going to get that down to zero unless we move to forms of packaging that are biodegradable, that are natural, and forms of packaging that aren't going to be left in landfill um, after we've finished using them. Eosta, an international distributor of fresh organic fruit and veg, is working with the Swedish supermarket. It says it sold 725,000 packs of organic avocados to them in 2015. Packing them required about 217 kilometers of plastic wrap.